family is facing backlash following a not-so-great purchase. The Logan pushes for a very special guest on Impulsive, plus LP's friend Mike explains his relationship with Logan. Hey guys, it's Allie for Hollywood Life, starting with Logan's friend Mike. Logan Paul's right-hand man uploaded a video for the first time in nearly a year to explain to the Logan just exactly who he is. I met Logan in 2016 at Travis Pastrana's house. You guys probably remember that vlog with Roman Atwood. <laughs> And then after that, we kind of remained friends. We hung out at Sundance, we hung out at Coachella. And then after Tokyo happened, I kind of started to be even more of a friend to him, more of an advisor, a big brother, a day-to-day, -day, his right-hand man, whatever you want to call it. Mike goes on to ensure the fans that he is in no way just hanging out with Logan for the clout and further confirms that he is not the reason for LP's split from Chloe Bennett. Now that's a relief. Mike's influence can definitely be felt in Logan's growth the last year. Maybe I should get a mic. Nick? You're canceled. And speaking of being canceled, users on social media are asking for the Ace family to be canceled after Austin uploaded Instagram stories where he buys his little sister a lollipop shaped like a penis. Austin's excuse for buying it for her was that she threatened to steal it if he didn't. It's a loose, loose situation. We're still waiting to see how the family reacts to the backlash, which they've yet to do. Instead, Austin has been promoting a $100,000 basketball challenge that looks like it'll include some interesting connections contestants like Jake and Logan Paul, Rice Gum, Nick Cannon, and even Soldier Boy, who we're going to be speaking with this month, so look out there for that. And also, he's a subscriber to Hollywood Life, so you should be too. But okay, from Ace to Impulsive, Logan Paul asked his fans who they want on a future episode, and of course, they said Chloe Bennett. Recall, we told you that Chloe recently refollowed Logan on Instagram, and this could mean good things for their friendship. Logan, however, still hasn't followed her back, so I wouldn't get my hopes too high about seeing her on the podcast. Chloe, do you want to come on our podcast? But all right, guys, hit the sub like and bell button and comment what you would do if you won $100,000. I know what I would do.